Welcome back. Tis the season to give back, and one suburban police department is doing just that by hosting a Pack the Paddy Wagon event all holiday season long. With us this morning to tell us how we can help is Sergeant Dwayne English with the Joliet Police Department. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks, thanks for, for having me. Thanks for being with us. This is not your first rodeo. How long has Pack the Paddy Wagon been going on? Well, it may we have not always been branded paddy wagon, but we've been doing a food drive at the Jolie Police Department for uh, within the last 10 to 20 years. Um, within the last five or six years, that's how we've uh, we've changed the name to it and branded it as Pack the Paddy Wagon. Okay, and why do this? Just a, this is a great way to reach out into the community and to help them. How does it make you guys and your officers, your department feel helping out the community? Well, this 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 is the our service side. Um, we have a duty to uh, our citizens of Joliet to provide a service, and um, this is the time of the year, right? Um, there's so many out there that you know need that extra push, especially at you know after the last couple of years, um, especially at the time where the holidays are coming up. Um, this this warms our heart. It it makes our officers very happy to be able to give back to the community in such such a positive way so you've been doing this for a while do you have any idea on average how much food you collected and what about last year did you do it last year and what was there a more response or obviously more need for something like this yes uh we we did see more of a need last year um i don't i don't have specific like uh weights or anything like that however as far as uh like a shopping cart we did fill about six to seven shopping carts full of food uh, to do donate to a organization here in Joliet. Um, I can tell you already this year, uh, we've only been doing this for a couple of weeks and we've already filled uh, well over two carts full of, of food and other items. That's great. So this goes to some sort of food bank. Can you tell us the organization? Sure. Uh, well, while we haven't uh, exactly identified the specific organization, I can tell you that um, in the past, we've we've provided to uh, local food banks, local homeless shelters, and last year specifically, we donated to a local domestic violence shelter. Oh, that's great! And how can we get involved? Where where's the paddy wagon? What kind of food are you looking for? How long do we have to help out? Well, we're looking for non-perishable items, and they can be dropped off at either of our police departments. Uh, our main police department is located at 150 West Washington and Joliet. And our far west facility is located at 70, 7691 West Caton Farm Road. Uh, we do have a collection bin at either department. And citizens have up till the week before Christmas to donate. Um, once we receive all those donations, that week before Christmas, we'll, we'll collect all the donations and we will donate it to the uh, organization that we have chosen. Okay, that's great. Well, thanks so much for being with us, Sergeant English. We appreciate that and appreciate what you do. Thank you very much for having me. Have a great morning. Thanks, you too.